story highlights horror crash at Val Gardena downhill Mark Gisson airlifted to hospital Alexander Amo killed the winds, CNN Swiss skier Mark Gisson suffered a horror crash in Saturday's World Cup men's downhill at Val Gardena won by Norway's Alexander Amo killed a The 30-year-old lost control just before the notorious camel hump section of the course and was thrown high into the air before sliding along the piste on his back and side. Visit CNN slash com slash sport for more news, features and videos The race was interrupted for half an hour while the unconscious Gizan received urgent treatment before being airlifted to hospital at Balzano. This is horrible to watch. Wishing it Mark Jason all the best. Comma December 15, 2018 His sister Michelle was quoted in the Italian media that her brother had regained consciousness, was stable and had broken his pelvis, but there was no official confirmation. Redmore Kilda and the other podium finishers Max Franz of Austria and Swiss Beat Fuse, were seen on television looking away as they witnessed the crash, with obvious concerns for Gisson's safety. Switzerland's Mark Gisson slid down the sass long piece on his back and side after a nasty crash just before the camel hump section of the downhill course. Both Gizan's sisters are world-class skiers, with Michelle winning combined gold at the Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang earlier this year and Dominique taking downhill gold in Sochi four years earlier. When racing resumed, Norway's Axel Lund Spindel, winner of the Super G Friday at the Italian Dolomite Resort, could only manage 7th place and he has lost his lead in the overall World Cup standings to Franz. A rescue helicopter transports Switzerland's Mark Gisson to hospital after his horror crash in the World Cup men's downhill at Val Gardena. It was the 26-year-old killed his second World Cup win, both in downhill, and comes off the back of an excellent third place in the Super G at Beaver Creek in the United States earlier this month. Reed, Schifrin punches historic win his time of 1 minute 56.13 seconds on the sass long course left him zero. Eighty-six seconds clear of Franz, with Fuse, 0.92 seconds behind. Fuse and Franz are joined top of the downhill standings after three rounds. Norwegian skiers had won seven of the last ten races at the Val Gardena weekend, dating back to 2014, while there was also a strong performance from the emerging U.S. team of Bryce Bennett, Steve Nyman and Travis Ganong in fourth, fifth and sixth. 